In this video, I am going to show you how to change letter and line spacing in Google Docs. So there may be times when you are working in your file and you want to change the spacing options, whether you want to change the spacing between words, lines, and paragraphs. Well, all of these things are pretty easy to control in Google Docs. However, you do have some limitations. So I'm going to go over a few different things in this video. I'm going to cover letter spacing, such as spacing between words or removing extra spaces. And I'm also going to show line spacing, like how to double space, paragraph spacing, and some custom spacing options that we have. So first, I'm going to cover letter spacing. And what I'm going to go over is how to change spacing between words. So sometimes when you're working in your file, you may want to increase the spaces between your words. And so the easiest way to do that is to use find and replace to re replace the spaces. So what you're going to do is first you're going to select the text that you want to change the spacing for. And so you can either highlight a specific portion or you can press control all or sorry, control and A to highlight everything. Or you can come to edit select all to highlight everything. So I'm going to press control A on my keyboard to highlight all. And then what you are going to do is you need to open up the find and replace tool. So you can either come to edit, find and replace, or looks like control and H will also open up find and replace or control F and click this three dot menu. So this is what we want. We want find and replace. So in this example, maybe I want to increase the spacing between my words from one space to two space. Well, then what I'm going to do in this find box, I'm going to find all instances of one space in my file. And you can see that it highlighted them here. And what we're going to do is replace it with two spaces. And then I will select replace all. Looks like it's lagging a little bit. And you can see it now increased my spacing. So that is changing the spacing between words is what you would do is just use find and replace to find a space and replace it with the amount of spaces that you want. So some people have been asking about kerning in Google Docs. And what kerning is, is it is the spacing between letters. Well, unfortunately, at this time, there is not an option for adjusting kerning in Google Docs. So I did want to let you know that in this video because some people have been asking. It may be a formatting option that they will add at some point in the future, but as of right now, you cannot change the kerning in Google Docs. So next I'm going to show you how to remove extra spaces. And so there may be times when you're working in your file where you notice some words have two spaces in between them. I'll just add a few here but then most have the one space. So if you notice that the spacing is off, you can also use the find and replace to fix that. So what you would want to do is again, select the text you want to edit, open the find and replace tool, whichever way you want to open it. And so I've noticed in my file that there's several instances where there's two spaces or I only want one space. So then what you are going to do is the opposite of what we just did. You're going to find two spaces and replace them with one space. So then replace all. And now I have removed the unwanted spaces by using find and replace to find them and replace them with the amount of spaces I want. So that would be removing extra spaces. So next I'm going to go over some line spacing options that we have. So one common thing that people want to do is double space their file. By default, Google Sheets is going to have about 1.15 lines of spacing between lines. 
And what you want, if you want it double spaced, is you want two spaced lines. So what we can do is highlight everything, again, whichever way you want to do it. And then you want to come to this line and paragraph spacing options button. So you can also access this through format. So line and paragraph spacing, they have all the same options in here. So I'm just going to click the button in the toolbar. And here are the options for line spacing. So if you want double spacing, you would just select the double option and you can see it added the double space in between my lines. So that would be double spacing. Next, I'm going to show you a few paragraph spacing options that you have. And this is again accessed through the same uh, line and paragraph spacing tool. So you just select this. And then if you want to add spaces before your paragraphs or after your paragraphs, you would just select that option and you can see it added an extra space. So that is how you change your paragraph spacing options. Now, if you want even more control over your spacing, maybe you want triple spacing, quadruple spacing, maybe you want to add multiple spaces before and after paragraphs. Well, that setting is also in this tool so you select it and then what you want to do is custom spacing so these are your custom spacing spacing options you have a custom line spacing option and then you have before and after um, paragraph spacing options so you can select whichever one you want and put in the appropriate amount of spacing that you're trying to get and apply that to your document so those are all of the spacing options that you have in Google Docs. So you do have a lot of control over the spacing, whether you want spacing between words, between lines, between paragraphs. All of that is done um, pretty easily. So hopefully you followed along with the whole video. If you have any questions, just let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching the video. If you haven't already, make sure to hit the subscribe button. If you have any questions or content suggestions, just let me know in the comments and I'll try my best to answer everyone.